Productions comes a space opera adventure like no other. Bubba Stargon and the Uranus Patrol! In our last episode, Bubba Stargon, Dr. Lenny Booz Hatfield, and Nurse Pristine Cathedral found themselves suddenly thrust in a parallel universe that's very much like their own, but with extreme differences. However, Bubba was a bit skeptical that this was the case and had to prove it for himself. Oh, dear. Dr. Hatfield, he's been in there an awful long time. Are you sure everything's all right? Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. C c come on, Pristine. As my nurse, you're aware of Bubba's medical records and that he's struggling with constipation, so, uh, you know, uh, give him a while. Holy crap! Oh my god! Oh jeez! Uh, oh, guys, uh, I mean, uh, look, uh, you don't want to go in there for a while, you know? <laughs> yeah, yeah, but holy crap! The toilet flowed counterclockwise. That means we're in a parallel universe! Yeah, no. Look here, Bubba. I've been researching the uh, past uh, recent events on the computer here. It seems things are really different here. Uh, apparently, uh, Earth uh, rules the entire star system. Uh, no Martians? No, nah, 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 well, we conquered them. Seems the only way <laughs> out for any kind of insurgency are the people in Venus. Oh, yeah, those uppity bitches. Doesn't shock me at all. Oh, I wonder what happened to Spot and why he's so badly scarred. Uh, well, according to uh, duty reports here, uh, yeah, yeah, he was in a fight with the uh, Venusian terrorists and there was an explosion, so I... Uh, and he lost an eye and uh, part of his ear. Oh, dear. And uh, apparently uh, the, the pristine of this universe nursed him back to health. And, well, uh, apparently they <laughs> they hit it off and uh, got married. What? You, oh, what? Man. Jeez, Louie. Well, that, that, that cinches it right there, Booze. I mean, this universe is evil. I mean, dogs marrying cats. Good Lord. Yeah, you probably got a point there, uh, Bubba. I've been looking through a lot of the history here, and apparently... People will rise through rank through backstabbing deals and outright murder. And the point of case here is uh, apparently you've achieved your rank as as the commander of this ship and the entire fleet through the apparent well, wait, no, murder of Johnny Ray. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I command the whole fleet. <laughs> oh man, I'm the big daddy in these here parts. <laughs> oh, well, we're gonna be all right then. Yeah, but Bubba, didn't you listen to me? Uh, the way people move up in rank is by killing the guy ahead of them. That means you've got the biggest target on your back around. Doctor, is the Admiral ready for duty? The Martian delegation has arrived, and as the commander of this vessel, he is required to receive our guests. Uh, well, Spot, uh, uh Tell him I'll be right over, booze. Hey, I don't know, uh, Bubba, are you sure? I mean, be careful. You know, you're not familiar with this place. Things could be different, and it could lead to trouble. <laughs> Would you relax, booze? Don't you know by now there's no greater bullshit master than me? Alright, I'll check back with you guys later. And soon on the bridge of this alternate version of the Edsel. Oh, uh, uh, Captain on the bridge! Uh, uh, oh, Tag! Damn, it's so weird. Supposed to be dead. Uh, 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 yeah, Tag, uh, take it easy there, buddy. Hey, Spud, how's it hanging? Bubba, your, your uniform is what? all filthy and damaged uh, from your oh, attack. Yeah. Well. On oh, Johnny Ray. Yeah, that bastard. Can't greet the Martians dressed like that. Oh. <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking, you know. I was just so quick to get back to work. And oh, stuff. it's quite all right, Mr. Spot. Eh? I'll be more than happy to help oh, Ludie. Captain change his clothes. Uh, <laughs> very well, <laughs> Lieutenant Ludy. However, that doesn't excuse the negligence of Ensign Tag. What? What? Uh, yes, uh, that's uh, right, uh, Ensign uh, Tag. You were assigned today uh, as attendant to the captain. Yeah, which but... you obviously uh, failed to do. Well, now, I'm sorry. Put your teeth and prepare no. for disciplinary... No, Mr. Spud! ...plug zapping. No, Mr. Spud! No! Final warning, no. Tag! No! <laughs> Is that smoke coming out of his ass? Mm, yes, 
this is quite stinking up the bridge. Don't just sit there like an idiot, Mr. Pollop! Oh, Pick oh, up Tag and sorry. haul this smoking ass down to the sick bay. And remind oh. the doctor oh. that it's past time for him to do a full crew inspection to oh, ensure oh. that everyone has their disciplinary butt plugs in place. Uh, uh, sir, yes, sir! Uh, hail Mother Earth! Holy shit, man! I mean, look! I always thought Tag was a pain in the ass, but... <laughs> oh, man. What the hell, you know? What the hell indeed? What other horrors lie ahead in this strange alternate universe? Find out in the next exciting episode of Bubba Stargon and the Uranus Patrol. Bubba Stargon and the Uranus Patrol is written and performed by me, Douglas Nelson, with music provided by Kevin McLeod and other public domain sources.